Hi everyone and welcome to our travel day to Prague. So this morning we flew with Ryanair at 20 past one. Yeah. This morning, this afternoon, should I say. <laughs> uh, with Ryanair in Manchester Airport to Prague Airport. We just landed and we just arrived at our hotel. And now we're staying at a place called Golden Angel Suites, which I'll show you. We'll pop a link in, in the description to show you. It's really nice. But first, catch us this morning when we were setting off in Manchester Airport. So now you join us at the point where we left you off at the start of the video. Yeah, let's go and have a look around the hotel and show you how amazing this place is. So as you enter through the front door, this is what it looks like in the room. So we're going to do a proper room tour video and show you that as like a separate video and show you all the little bits in the room just so you catch up with us and you can see where we're up to in the room but what we're going to show you is one more thing which is our view in the background so so nice really nice like a nice view of the city so let's spin you around let's have a look at the view so we've got a couple of windows for the view we'll just show you this one here now vicky kindly open it for us you can see a little glimpse there i will well, this is like kind of like open, but I think the other one will still just it just door. opens up like the balcony, but yeah, no, it does open. You're right. Stunning. Look at that. Zoom you out. Look at that. So we're just having a chill on the sofa. Vicky's enjoying a pepper army. Uh, yeah, we're just having a chill after the flight and everything. We forgot to mention how we got from the airport to the hotel. So we took a Uber, mm -hmm. and it was called Uber Airport. So they have like specific Ubers that go mm -hmm. straight from the airport. Desks. Yeah, yeah, they have little desks. We showed you on a little video where you literally put in your, your details, where you go in, and then straight away, within one minute, we, t we walked outside and we were like, Golden Angel. He was like, yeah, straight in. So we walked. Brilliant. Yeah, went inside the, the Uber, took about 25 minutes. Really nice Uber. Got to say as well, it was beautiful. Yeah. Very clean, very nice. Yeah, twenty five really? minutes I think it took to the to the centre. Yeah, yeah, it wasn't long. Um, and we just thought for the convenience, there was other options. So you do have options to go via buses. So they have, I think it's one one nine bus and the airport express bus, mm. um, which are obviously a lot cheaper. But we just thought convenience wise, time wise, because our flight was delayed a little bit. And this is door to door as well. So the Uber brings you literally directly outside the doors, but with the bus and the train, you have to walk a bit. Yeah. 
So, because of the time and night, we were just thought convenience. It wasn't that expensive, so we were like, screw it ourselves. <laughs> yeah, why, why not? I think it was just over, I think, 20 euros. Yeah. It works out at about 17 50 or something. I don't even know the exact price, um, but we'll put the price in now. Um, but yeah, no, it was really good, really convenient. Turned up at the hotel, everything's gone smoothly at the moment, yep. so we're going to enjoy our little rest here and then we're going to head out for some tea and I think we're just going to go for something nice, quick and easy, what we're going for tonight, mate. McDonald's, because we have to try it everywhere we go to compare it and it's just nice and quick and easy. Yeah, we it? like so. seeing like different stuff on the menu as well. Yeah. So we'll bring you along to McDonald's in a second. So that's where we're heading, the Palladium shopping. Vicky spotted Sephora. I've seen the upside, I'm, I'm seeing the upside down tree and Vicky spotted Sephora. Is that, you, is that where you want to head? Let's go then. <laughs> we found our way around. Yes, we have. Heading into Savara. Vicky's in an element here. Look at her, look at her. Unfortunately, not a successful shop in Sephora there. So I think we're coming to like the food court here. A lot of different options around here. This looks like a nice place. Got the seats here as well. Oh, like wood fired pizzas there. Thai restaurant. Loads of different options on this top floor. Then they have more of your fast food places. They have like a pastry place, I'm assuming. Yeah, like baguettes they sell. And you have like your Burger King, KFC, McDonald's, Pizza Hut. Me and Vicky just found out that Pizza Hut's an express place, so we'll go and have a look at that first and then maybe have a look at McDonald's after that. Because they're right next door to each other, so why not? got our pizza hut and um, we've got a little story to tell you when we get back to the hotel and just like that we're back into the room come Vic do the honours okay so excited to eat this oh yes so it's a sweet pepperoni pizza that we got and it's got pepperoni and sweet corn we were a bit unsure what it's got sweet pepperoni men. No, I, I have a look online. Basically just means it's got sweet corn on. But really excited for that, looks nice. Let's get our plates and let's get stuck in. So we're about to tuck in. Really excited to try this pizza. I'm gonna let Vicky do the first on us. Right, can I just ask a question? If anybody knows the purpose of these, can you please let us know what the actual purpose is in the comments? I think I saw it on my seen, video. Yeah, I've seen so many different things like, oh, it's to put your finger on when you pull your pizza. It's for, so I don't, I don't know, I don't know what it, what it's for. So if you know, let us know in the comments. I feel like you might be right there, you know. Let's try it, go on. Ooh. Oh, Ooh. oh, it's a good job oh. it's just two of us eating, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Hands are all over it. All right, go on, bit. let's try it. Oh. What? That is really good. Yeah? Mmm. Does it, to be fair, the cheese is that, I don't know, it just looks really nice. Tell you what, pizza hot over Domino's. Whatever. Pizza hot over Domino's or what? I don't think there's tomato sauce on this. Oh, oh yeah, you might be right. There's no tomato sauce. You know, like tomato puree on the yeah, bottom. But yeah, but it doesn't feel like it's lacking it. Like it, it still tastes nice. Please here. Danny's going for the one with the most amount of sweet corn on. Oh, <laughs> right. How is it? Mmm. Nice flavour, isn't it? The cheese. Yeah. Cheese is nice, and it's not like stringy cheese where it's like no, too much and almost yeah. like choking you. It's really nice, but like I say, with the um, the it having no like tomatoey base. It's not missing it. Like, you don't feel like, oh, it's lacking something because... I mean, it would be nice with tomato sauce, but it just tastes good, doesn't it? 
So this is the story. I'm going to let Vicky explain explain because she had something that she did really well. Um, so basically, when you order, there's no like way of queuing or anything. You just kind of all like stand back and just wait for your number to come up on, up on the board. They don't shout your number or anything. So we were waiting. Shows you which ones are getting prepared and which ones are ready. Um, and I noticed it was getting up to hours. So I was stood there waiting. Um, and then I just noticed the girl that was like preparing the pizzas. She looked at the screen and then looked a bit confused. And this was like when our pizza was supposed to be the next one. And she was looking and she was like a bit confused. So then she walked over to the people making the pizza um, and she said something. And then I think he was like the manager. He seemed like the manager. He came out and was looking confused as well. And I said to Danny, I said, I think they've forgotten to make our pizza. Anyway, turns out we were right because we saw our pizza then go on to the conveyor belt thing eventually. And then when Danny went to pick up the pizza, the manager guy um, came out and basically gave us three free pizza vouchers. So he basically said it's like small pizzas for free in yeah. any pizza hut in Czech Republic. And you have to use it until well, you basically got to the end of the year. And obviously yeah. we're here, so... We might pretty much we should use them for lunch, don't we? Yeah, so three small pizzas, but we just thought that was really, really nice, didn't it? Yeah, it's, we only waited like five minutes Yeah, extra. it wasn't that long. Like, we, we had waited a bit longer, but it wasn't an issue. So we were really thankful we wouldn't no, have said anything. I think because you spotted it, we were like... Yeah. We weren't like as bothered. Sometimes I think, it, I guess if you wouldn't have spotted it, you might have been like, where's our pizza mm. kind of thing. But no, so it, was only, it was only five minutes extra. So mm. really nice one to give them. Let's go. We'll just enjoy our pizza now. Um, and then we'll see you after. We'll see you soon. So we've worked our way back into the Palladium shopping centre. And there's two more floors that we've not explored yet. And we've just seen this like wafer shop here, which we're going to go and have a look in now. So this is a shop that we're going to head into called Mana Shop, which is like it looks like Pink Panther, basically wafers. That's a reference. So there's loads of stuff in here to look at. I think we're going to go for this wafer which is like a hazelnut wafer and it's only 11.90 in Czech crowns so it's like 50p really so good cheap. yeah you spotted anything else these oh these gingerbread like gingerbread but in like the uh, powdered sugar coating yeah. i think they'd be nice 55.90 which is about two pound odd you get some of these you try them yeah. if you like them yeah let's go for them yeah they look good yeah yeah so here's the wafers that we're going for we also have these above. Mm, these mini ones here. I think let's try one of these minis, but yeah. how many's in there? Four in them ones for 37 nine. Might as well get one just to try. Yeah. Yeah. Successful shopping manor. Little paste, a little uh, pink pamper shop there. Really nice. Pink, pink pamper shop, yeah. <laughs> We're just gonna have a walk around now. Um, explore these last two floors and then maybe have a little walk around Prague city centre. So we're just going to head into this supermarket here and try and find some little bits just for snacks. Yep, so we're going to get some bananas which are 59.90 per, per kilo, kilo, yeah. Which yeah. probably be. Bag. Yeah, get a bag. Get a bag yeah. Probably turn out to be one pound summer, I'm guessing. Of course, Vicky's gone down the chocolate aisle, biscuit aisle. I don't know if anything jumps out. Seem to be quite big on like, the wafers, don't they? They have quite a lot here. So I picked up some cereal, which is like your special care. Um, summer berries kind of special care. Some milk. And then Vicky's picked himself up some fizzy sweets. And then a little kid's yogurt. <laughs> it's like They're mini, so nice. mini like smarties on top. <laughs> Feel Oh. Becky's favourite thing to do on holiday, isn't it, Vic? Ooh. <laughs> Sorry, I'm, I'm literally getting fried chicken. I'm doing the show for fried chickens. <laughs> <laughs> She's got the fried chicken crisp there. 29.90. Vicky's spotted, spotted the barbecue in there. We'll, we'll be getting some of them in Florida. I'm now. I'm now? Yeah. <laughs> Look at her. 
Nike has just picked itself up some of this. Looks a bit like the San Pellegrino. Yeah. And that was 31.90. About £1.50. Gonna go and grab ourselves some fruit now as well. Other than bananas. <laughs> successful little shop there. Lots of more in here as well. Yeah, successful little shop. We'll show you what we got when we get back to the hotel. And um, that's where we're heading now. So we've just come out of the shopping centre now. And we've got the powder towder here. <laughs> which, which pretty much leads to our hotel. Um, really stunning views there. Everything looks so nice lit up at night. Yeah, it does. It just looks, restaurant, it? restaurant looks nice. Oh, yeah, it just looks really nice. Okay, so here's our little collection. We'll, we'll go through what we got. So we've got the basically like a San Pellegrino lemon kind of fizzy drink, iced tea, which is a peach iced tea, peach and lemon maybe, milk, water, barbecue layers, these fried chicken crisps that you saw, little chocolate chip croissant, bananas, some cereal for the mornings, grapes, two calippos, tropical and the strawberry one. A little yogurt for Vicky and some sweets and that all came to 13.85 which is really good yeah it's good that for for what we got um so yeah and then fancy supermarket as well yeah it was so we was quite expected it to be so cheap which was a nice surprise yeah it was really nice and then you saw what we got from that manor uh, and then gingerbread kind of sugar ones and two wafer kind of bits so yeah we're gonna basically have a little chill Pop the TV on and we shall catch you in a second. You can see our snacks kind of lining up in the corner here. Fill the fridge up and ready to stick the TV on and watch them. So we've had our little chill. We watched one episode of Sex Education. We're nearly there at the end of that one. Um, and we're just ready for bed now. Nikki's in her PJs, I'm um, ready for, for bed as well. It's about, was it quarter to 12 now? Yes, around that time, I think about 10 to quarter to 12. Yeah, and we're gonna have like a day tomorrow sightseeing. So this is going to be the end of our travel day vlog. We are going to add, obviously, our two days, three days in Prague vlog coming up soon. So go and watch that if you're interested in that. Um, thank you all for watching. I hope you've all enjoyed it. Um, and subscribe if you can. That will mean the world to us. Like or comment any questions down below, especially that pizza comment that I mentioned before. Oh, yes. We, we want to know that, yeah. We do. <laughs> but yeah, thank you all for watching and roll on the next one.